On Wednesday night, LFC lifted the Premier League trophy for the first time in the club's history. They secured their 19th title, leading to an outpouring of emotion from fans who've been waiting 30 years for them to lift the trophy. Jürgen Klopp said it was a special feeling after Liverpool's final home game of the season, in which they beat Chelsea 5-3. The champions finally got their hands on the silverware in a very special ceremony, featuring Sir Kenny Daglish on the cop at Anfield, broadcast around the world. Liverpool Football Club released a statement thanking those supporters who stayed at home to celebrate. They say, though, they're disappointed with the scenes outside Anfield, where around 3,000 people gathered. Officers made a total of nine arrests outside the stadium for a fray, assault, people who were drunk and disorderly and drug driving. Police also introduced a 48-hour dispersal zone at 9.30pm on Wednesday. Officers will be patrolling the Anfield area to enforce it until 9.30pm on Friday. However, in a statement, police said the vast majority of the crowd were good-natured and had dispersed by 2am. Thankfully, we didn't see the sort of incidents of disorder and criminal damage we saw at the pier head on June 27th. The Reds thanked those from Clean Event and Liverpool Street Scene Services who did incredible work on Thursday morning clearing up Anfield and the surrounding areas. The current pandemic means there will not be a victory parade in the near future, but the City Council says alternative plans are being made to mark the incredible achievement in an appropriate manner. The City will surely be celebrating for some time to come.